Hey everyone, FyGuy448 here, and welcome to a brand new Minecraft series. This is Project Ozone 2 Reloaded. And uh, don't worry you guys, the uh, other series will still be going. However, I uh, decided to kind of put that on the shelf for just a little bit. Uh, main reason being is I want to start diving into some mods. And uh, the last series... Ooh, hold on just a second. All right, we have a village right there at our spawn. Uh, fantastic news. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get started, and I want to tell you a little bit about uh, why I started this series and uh, kind of the reasoning behind it and all that. Um, as I just mentioned, I do want to start diving into some uh, modded Minecraft. The uh, other series is vanilla, and it's more of a kind of a, I guess, a relaxation sort of series where we just kind of casually hang out and do our thing. Uh, this one, it it actually covers um, I think it's somewhere in the neighborhood of 200 mods it's absolutely insane so I figured if we're gonna do modded Minecraft uh, we might as well jump in and uh, go hardcore so that is what I have done and as you can see I have some stuff that's already in my hotbar and the reason being is uh, it does uh, start us out with a little bit and uh, we'll go ahead and check out the quest book in just a sec. I do want to dive down and, and get in that village and check that out and see what all we've got as well. But um, let me get this tree here and uh, go ahead and check out this quest book real quick. All right. Um, for those of you who are not familiar with quests, uh, these books basically, they kind of guide you through the, the game itself. Whereas our last series is just kind of open-ended and we kind of do whatever we want to do. This one uh, actually kind of walks you through some stuff. So, uh, and of obviously we can uh, choose to do whatever we want to do. But uh, in those cases, this book will kind of give us a, a path that we can follow. Uh, so that way we do have a little bit more structure than the other series. Um, I'm not going to read this to you. Um, I'll leave it up here. If you guys want to read it, go ahead and pause the video and uh, read that. But basically, it's just kind of just a little bit of a background. I'm not familiar with the original one. I guess there was one prior to this. So uh, we're just going to kind of jump right in and uh, get rolling. And uh, as you can see, there are three lives. This is different from my other series. Uh, when I have died three times, it's over. So uh, let's try not to do that. Um, there are also 527 quests in total, so we, uh, we've got our work cut out for us. Also, uh, one other thing about this uh, mod pack is, as you can see, Alpha, Beta, Gamma, Delta, Epsilon, Zeta, Eta. Um, the only one that's unlocked right now is Alpha, and if I click on that, uh, these are the mods that it basically covers. And it looks like as we go, it gets into some more complicated mods which honestly is perfect for someone like me who's not all that familiar uh, with mods and this is just the alpha one and wow there is some crazy looking stuff here but uh, let's go ahead and get our first diamond uh, we've got a diamond already um, let's go ahead and get that all right um these chance cubes Ooh, don't know why we doubled up there um, I am not going to mess with those chance cubes. Um, uh, dirt chest. Oh, that's pretty garbage. But anyway, let's dive down into this village. Let me take one, one more tree down because we do want to get some wood. Um, the, uh, the chance cubes, I don't know if I want to mess with them. I've seen them in other series, and uh, they're generally not good. And with only three lives, especially at this early stage, uh, I've got literally no armor, uh, nothing. I don't know if I want to take the chance. So we may um, just kind of save those and we'll get those, uh, we'll open those later on. Now, um, my understanding is that there are chance cubes that are out randomly in the world. Um, we might take a chance and, and open some of those. Uh, I'll be honest with you, uh, probably not. Uh, sheep good let's get us some sheep because I want to make sure that we can sleep through the night um, oh Minicio I recognize that from a series that I watch um, there's a whole bunch of stuff you can do with that stuff oh did that thing just bite me 
Oh, wow, okay. I guess the passive mobs, they uh, fight back. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> if I get a death from a stupid sheep, um, I'm going to be pretty upset. All right, let's get in here, and I'm not going to mess with chickens because there's a whole bunch of those. Um, all right, that looks pretty standard stuff. Um, oh, looks like we've got a leak already. Oh, garden. That'll be cool. Um, oh, uh, tinker stuff. Okay, good. We'll leave you trapped in there. Um, let's see what else we got. Um, let's go ahead and plug that hole while we're at it. I'm trying to hustle here because... Uh, what? All right, that's kind of strange. Where is that coming from? Really weird. Um, there seems to be a lot of source blocks here. Um, okay. All right, that's what we need right there. Blacksmith, um, unknown dimlet. We're just gonna go. Ooh, iron. Good, good, good. Black lotus emit strong vibes. All right. Not quite sure. Let's um, go ahead and get some of these things out of here that we don't need right now. Um, let's uh, start. Let's get some of this going here. All right, um, uh, this is crazy because uh, early on, I kind of want to protect the village here and uh, make sure that the villagers are a-okay. I'm already getting hungry. Um, yeah, like I said, we're, we'll dive into the quest in just a little bit, but right now I do want to at least get some basics going. Um, one other thing too is uh, tools they are a lot different oh oh what do we have up here is that tinkers construct yes it is okay that's kind of what I figured um, I took a very brief look at the mods in here I did not um, I'll, admittedly I did not uh, really go all out and look at what they were so um oh, there's a blue cow is that a blue cow all right i'm um, not sure what you do fluid cow liquid nitrogen interesting um yeah so uh a lot of these mods i have not seen ever before uh tinker's construct is a pretty common one uh, that one I have seen in different series that I've watched. Um, I do watch other YouTubers. Um, and, you know, I'm just starting out, so I'm trying to get some inspiration and some ideas um, from those guys. So I have watched a, a fair amount of what some other YouTubers have done, uh, mainly in Minecraft as well. But uh, I am somewhat familiar with Tankers, or at least I've seen it. Uh, a lot of these other mods I haven't a clue about, so we uh, will likely learn together and I do want to get some torches up not that it'll help but it'll give me a little bit of peace of mind here all right um where's our village oh gosh it's already starting to get dark oh now with some of these mods I uh, you there's obviously going to be a lot of uh, derping around here. I need to find a building to crash in. Um, I might just block this off. Um, yeah. If I can get some torches up. Um, come on, get in your houses, guys. Okay, that should be good. Um, I'm going to 
gonna dip in here in just a moment. Trying to buy a little bit of time. Okay. I think it's time for me to uh, retreat here. There we go. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this just because it's usually in the way. Um, all right. Let us see what we've got here. Let's get some light up here. All right. Oh, oh crap. All right. Yeah, dummies, get in the building. All right, yeah, see me, see me. Good, good, good. Oh no, um, not what I wanted. Really not what I wanted. Oh, 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 um, hello. You seem to have found your way in. So have you. I probably need to fix that. Um, alright, um, yeah, since I've got a nice little mess right there, let's, um, I don't think I can do much about that, ah! That'd be really cool if you get out. Alright, um, let's... Hopefully uh, that will not burn. Um, wow. Um, okay, let's uh, make sure no one can see us here, because, um, um, wow. Okay, not off to the greatest of starts, guys. Definitely not. So, um, we got our work cut out for us. All right, um, we lost a couple villagers, it appears, and they're still running around like dummies. Disposable item turret. Oh, gosh. Okay, good. That chest did not blow up. Disposable item turret. Uh, it's interesting. Looks like it just kind of shoots stuff, maybe. Um, got some wood there. Don't need you. Um, gosh, um, 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 that probably was not the best idea in the world. Yeah, I have no door. There's an enderman taking some stuff. It appears that our, oh, no, no, whoa, what is going on there? Um, um, okay, let's, uh, let's get on out of here, um, let's run, oh, what is this, oh, no, 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 wow, okay, 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 um, 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 I am in a world of hurt, I am in a world of hurt, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, um, I don't even know where to go. I got a whole bunch of, oh, a witch, great, just what I need, oh, nope, 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 oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, okay, um, I'm gonna die, unless I get some health, alright, um, I need to regen some health, alright, I got one heart, I guess it was some Tinker's Construct stuff that blew up in that building. So, yeah. Um. I got a bunch of spiders after me. Let's, uh, just swim around here for a minute. Oh, is that a chance cube under the water there? Uh-oh. 
Uh -oh, uh -oh. Um, I'm going to beat you with a tree. How about that? Um, oh, no, no, no. That's not nice. Let's uh, go ahead and beat you with a tree. Um, the knights are a little brutal. Um, well, actually, a lot brutal. These uh, hair trigger creepers, especially. Um, you know what? Let's. Uh, I have no idea what I'm backing into. So let's just uh, kind of go around in circles here. dare get that. I need it. Alright, let's see if I can get to the surface without any damage. Uh oh, go, 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 go. Um, wow. Okay. So, there's that. Um, I don't even know what to think about that right now. Uh, experience, 13 out of 17, awesome. Um, do we dare? <laughs> I mean, it can't get a whole lot worse than we've already done. Um, no, I'm not going to mess with that right now. Oh, there's another one over there. Oh, wow. Um, hmm. Let's see if we can get on some land safely. You know what? Let's go collect some sand over there. Don't know why. Um, oh, actually, I do know why. Because, um, oh, look at all the skeletons. All right, maybe we won't collect sand over there. Maybe we'll see if we can. Uh, we got a couple zombies there. I can deal with those guys, I think. I'll beat them with an apple. Whap. Oh, I have uh, filled up my inventory. Oh, wow, okay. There's all the Tinker's Construct stuff. So, there's that. Alright, there's a skeleton there. That's not what I need. I need you to stay up there on the land because I need. Um, yeah, we'll uh, let you go and do your thing over there. Meantime. Oh my gosh. This is bad, guys. Like, really bad. Um, how did not die? I do not know. Look at all those mobs. Oh my gosh. Um, is this the way it's going to be every single night? I surely hope not. I mean, look at this. This is crazy. Look at all these creepers. Um, um, I mean, I can deal with skeletons. I can deal with zombies. Uh, the creepers is, are really... That's that's what bothers me because there's so many of these things. Yeah, go ahead and burn. Skeleton uh, spider shouldn't mess with me. I do need to kill some for strength. Oh, do they drop some goodies? Well, at least they appear to drop goodies. Um, what do I not need? Um, gosh, this is this is insanity. Um, bones. I might need those. Um, I don't know. It, that is a wither skeleton. Let let us not mess with that. I need string. Oh my gosh, I need string so freaking bad. Um, what can I get rid of? An egg. Let's see if we can swing back through and get that string. Um, okay. There's a chance cube. Oh, no, no, no. I can't mess with you. There's some more string. 
Oh, are those weather skeletons? Yeah, well, I mean, obviously they are, but... Uh, this mod pack has slightly different um, mechanics. So I don't know if they will wither you or what the deal is. It just says skeleton. I don't know if I want to take the chance. Maybe you'll drop something cool. Um, oh, um, oh, gosh, what do I get rid of? Uh, fence posts, whatever. Bread. I don't need you. Um, okay. Cool. Should I deal with this other guy? Yeah, let's go ahead and kill this other guy. Do not want this guy to touch me. If I can help it. String. Um, where'd you go? Where'd you go? There you go. All right. We are wasting a lot of time doing this. Um, bones. I think those will come in handy. Oh. Um. Eh, no. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's get a tree here. Gosh, oh my gosh, this is nuts. I don't even want to see what happened over there. Um, I've got to get a bed. i got to be able to sleep through the night. That is numero uno here. Um, I have no idea what all that experience stuff is in the uh, corner up there. You know, let's eat the bread. I need to get the wood. I really hope that the uh, destruction over here wasn't as terrible as I thought it. Oh my gosh, it is. Um, should I even try for that? Yeah, why not? Oh no. Nope, 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 nope. Um, 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 uh, don't die. Oh my gosh. That was not intelligent at all, at all. All right, um, I'm gonna end this here and let us, uh, yeah, you know what? Let's go over here and have some fun. We'll end the episode, we'll break this sucker and see what happens. Um, I have a feeling that's not a good thing. We're done.
Hey everyone, FyGuy448 here, and welcome to a brand new Minecraft series. This is Project Ozone 2 Reloaded. And uh, let me go ahead and get started here because we have a lot to do. Um, oh, village. Awesome. Good spawn. Um, the, uh, oh, what are you guys, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Um, okay. Sheep fight back. Um, I'm basically getting sheep for a bed, but, uh, um, oh my gosh. Okay, um, let me, uh, deal with these guys real quick. Oh. Alright, I'll beat you with your own flesh. Okay, um, alright. <laughs> Crazy start. For those of you who are wondering where the old Minecraft series is, uh, it's still alive. And uh, I'm just kind of putting it on a shelf for just a minute. And the uh, reason being is I just uh, I wanted to get into uh, some mods, um, some modded Minecraft. I know the other one has got a few mods, but I really wanted to uh, kind of embrace uh, modded Minecraft. And after looking around, uh, this mod pack is uh, definitely the way to go. It has, um, I believe, close to 200 different mods in it. And I don't know what the vast majority of them are, to be perfectly honest with you. Um, it does have some of your old standbys, Tinker's Construct. Um, I believe it has got Pam's Harvest Craft in it. Um, and it's got a bunch of tech mods in it, like uh, I believe Applied Energistics. Um, all sorts of craziness. Uh, I would put the list of mods in the description, but uh, that would be an extremely large description. If you do want to see all the mods, uh, you can get this mod pack through the Curse Launcher. So if you guys play Minecraft and have the Curse Launcher, then uh, go ahead and get you. Uh, go ahead and check out that list. All right, we do have enough for a bed. Fantastic. All right, let me uh, go ahead and get this tree, and then we'll go down and dive into that village. But um, you'll notice that I do have some uh, items in my hotbar already when I first started, before I uh, started hacking at the sheep. And uh, the item in slot number three is of particular importance. Uh, this is a mod pack that has a quest line to it. And for those of you who are not familiar with that, it is basically a book where you uh, complete tasks and as you complete the tasks you get rewards for them. And it provides a little bit of structure to Minecraft, which I know is a little strange. But uh, our last series is just kind of open-ended. We kind of do wander around, you know, do what we want. This one actually provides us with a little bit of structure. So, um, you know, in those days that uh, we just kind of don't feel like uh, coming up with something new to do, well, guess what? We can follow the quest. Oh, wow. A lot of this stuff is built already. Nice. Um, all right, we got some gardens in here. Uh, but anyways, the, uh, uh, okay, it looks like we got a little bit of damage. And, um, oh wow, is that, what is that? Looks like we got Tinker stuff. Um, I am not going to stick around in this village um, the first night. The reason, what is all this craziness? Um, okay, we are not going to mess with that. Um, I am actually going to bail the first night. And the reason being is, um, I want to... Uh, we'll, we might use this village as a means to, you know what we should do? Let's, uh, does this place have a, ah, uh, yes, blacksmith, good. Um, what I am going to do is go ahead and get some of that going. And hopefully we've got some cool, st oh, iron, fantastic. Um. You know what? I don't know if I'll have much. I'm just going to... Uh, let's go ahead while we wait for that and check out this quest book. Um, Project Ozone 2 Reloaded. I am not going to read all this to you. If you guys want to see it, go ahead and pause the video here and uh, read through it. But basically, um, it's just a whole bunch of craziness. Uh, there is a Project Ozone, I guess an original one. I'm not familiar at all with it. Uh, I happened to see it on the list as I was scrolling through. Uh, this one was the most recent, so this is the one I went with. 
Um, but uh, as you can see, one thing that is different from the other series is you will see three hearts here. Those are my lives. I have currently died zero times. When I have died three times, this thing is over with. So uh, we have to be very careful of that. Now we can get lives through uh, quest completions, is my understanding, or partial lives. So uh, we'll have to make sure that we do complete quests. We have 527 of them total, so that should keep us busy. Um, but uh, also uh, one thing, Alpha, Beta, Gamma, Delta, you'll notice that all these are locked. Um, if you click on Alpha, it, it uh, lists the different mods that it uh, messes with in this particular, um, I guess, chapter. Um, as we go, the mods seem to get more complicated, so that's really perfect for someone like me who is not at all familiar with the mods. As you can see, there's a truckload in here. Uh, I imagine the other ones are just as extensive. So uh, let's go ahead and complete this reward. Uh, since we gave us a diamond of florb, no idea what that is. Chance cubes. Hmm. I want to talk to you guys in a minute about those chance cubes, but we're going to leave that sucker right there. Um, I have seen other series with chance cubes, and um, it, it hasn't ended well. So um, I am not going to mess with those chance cubes, at least at this point. Cat ears. Um, equipable and amulet. Thick eyebrows. Equipable. <laughs> um, sure. Let's put on some cat ears and thick eyebrows, right? I have no idea what those do, but we'll go with the thick eyebrows for now and we'll put the cat ears in there. Uh, we'll put our florb away. Um, I don't care so much about seedlings. All right, uh, we got to hustle because... Um, oops. Let's get us some food cooked, and I know this is immensely wasteful, but, um, yeah, let's get us, that should be plenty, um, we'll go ahead and let that burn, and then we are, we are gonna, 50 emeralds and 4 seeds for sulfur seeds, are you out of your mind? You are insane. What about you? Okay, you're more reasonable. Your buddy over there is a little bit off his rocker. Tool station and for a copper ore berry bush. <laughs> nice eyebrows, buddy. All right, uh, let us get gone. Um, we'll burn one more here, and then we have got to get out of here. Um, And we will come back and slowly fortify this village. But uh, right now we've got to scoot. All right, that's good. Let's get out of here quickly. Um, that hill right back there looks like a great spot. So let us run away. And you might be asking, why, why? Well, all those villagers, ha what is that? You're like a fluid cow. Um, salt fluid. Okay. Um, we are just going to head in this direction. Um, well, not too far, I guess. And we're going to dig in the mountain this first night, and we'll look through the quests. Um, Hopefully, oh, um, is that a lighting glitch? Yeah. All right. Uh, we've got to find a safe place to hide. Um, let's run over here real quick. Um, I don't want to go too, too terribly far away from the village, but I want to go far enough away where we don't have to worry about a whole bunch of craziness spawning. Um, this looks like a good little place to hide out. I hope. Alright. Alright, 
um, we'll go ahead and do that. And we'll go ahead and do that. Um, yeah. Crap. Um, we're going to deal with this. Alright, we are going to just seal that up for right now. Um, no, that wasn't good. Okay, um, hmm, lighting glitch is troublesome, but we'll work with it. Since it is getting dark, let us check out our quest book real quick. Um, actually, let us make some torches real quick. Don't want too many. Let's, that, yeah, that'll work for now. Okay, um, close enough. Ooh, not a good idea. Let's, uh, um, no, I don't want anything to see in here. I've heard some very bad things about what can happen. All right, uh, let's check out this quest book a little bit deeper here. Um, all right, we have got begin again. Oakwood, crafting station, and a crook. Um, we can actually do that right now, I do believe. I think we have enough wood. Um, oh, actually, it requires oak, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, we can do this, at least. And that should give us the crafting station. Should it not? Okay, it does. Um... I wonder why it's not counting the acacia planks. Um, dark wood, let's just, uh, wow. Colored wood, colored wood, colored oak, colored oak. Okay, we can do some wild things with some buildings, I guess. Um, wow, ooh. Gray oak, that looks interesting. Cyan, purple, wow. Yeah, we're gonna, yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff here. Uh, crook, should we go ahead and do that? Um, yeah, let's do that while we're stuck in here. If you look at the mini map, we got a whole bunch of mobs hanging out out there. Oh, you know what we should do? Ah, we should have made a bed. That's what we are going to do right now. Um, I'm not going to worry about sleeping through this first night, but um, that is one of the most important things that I could ever make, at least at this point in time. Alright, let us make some... Let's make a simple crook. That is going to come in handy because we are going to need some string. Um, looking at one of the Oops, the mods. Um, oh gosh, I cannot believe that varnish planks, scorch planks. It's got every plank under the sun except acacia. So we will have to go find us a an oak tree. Pound the ground, cobblestone, zero sixty four. Um, one thing about the uh, the tinker's mod is because we do have the tinker's mod. We cannot make tools in the traditional manner. Meaning, if I were to make a wooden pickaxe right now, um, it would be pretty much useless. So uh, it would it would be good for one use only, and it would break. Same with stone. Same with uh, iron. Same with gold, and even same with diamond. If I were just to make any sort of tool the traditional Minecraft way it would only have a durability of one so we could use it to break one block or hit one thing if it was a sword and it would immediately break so we are going to have to dive into uh, Tinker's Construct pretty quickly here and uh, I think the village already had the workstations and all that set up so that's good 
because that, that puts us ahead of the curve. Um, let's see, while we're stuck here in the dark, because it is uh, shortly after midnight game time, as you can see in the upper left, um, the biome, savannah, okay, that's kind of cool. I have no idea what that experience, 6 out of 17 means. Um, not a clue. I don't even know what mod that's from. Uh, you'll see the upper right is got our mini map with a bunch of baddies out there, and I have no idea what all those things with the googly eyes are. They do not look like fun. I recognize a spider, a couple skeletons. Um, oh, maybe those are squids since we're kind of near the water. Okay, that's cool. Oh, and a zombie just popped up. Um, let's take a look, and we've got a hundred and ooh, a backpack accessories companion neckwear shield miscellaneous ring ring i cannot get over those uh, eyebrows those are pretty cool i have no idea what that is gloves all right um backpack hopefully there are backpacks in this um bubbles Oh, okay, good. We do have back. We have heart containers. Fantastic. That'll that'll be good as well. Oh, galactic craft. So we can go to space, other planets. Ew. All right. It looks like we are going to have a bunch of. Oh, let's get out of that. Loaded chunk zero of fifty. Um. All right, let's just take a look at this real quick. All right, um, I'm just going to flip through here and see if I recognize anything. Um, looks like a lot of building stuff. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. Um, yeah, it looks pretty standard thus far. What is all this mess? Artifact, leather armor. Um, mystical. Okay, looks like we got some magic stuff in here. Ooh. Healing diamond chest plate of fresh air. Water breathing when equipped. Heals the player when equipped. We definitely need to look into that diamond chest plate of armor. Oh. Water breathing. Wow. Okay. There's some crazy, crazy senses nearby ores when equipped just play to toughness okay we've got some cr oh what is all this mess yeah if you guys are familiar with any of these mods um small wizard tower yeah, if you guys are uh, familiar with any of these mods, please don't hesitate to uh, kind of fill me in and let me know what's going on. Uh, Bibliocraft. Okay, that's a that's another cool mod. Um, as far as building stuff goes, um, not too terribly handy for dealing with the craziness that we have to deal with. But once we kind of get ourselves established, uh, it'll be kind of cool to uh, mess with that just a little bit. Biblio Woods Matura Edition. All right. Um, wow. Okay. Looks like we've got all sorts of craziness in here. Mossy Dreamwood. Robotics. Carpenter's Blocks. I recognize that mod. Um, Computer Craft. That is one I don't know if we're going to mess with too much. Uh, that dives into programming, and I don't really know what I'm doing when it comes to that sort of stuff. Um, I'm sure I'll probably, at some point, we'll probably mess with it a little bit, or at least try it out. I do want to try out at least um, you know, a little bit of every one of these mods uh, to see how deep we can go with it. Um, defense tech but the uh, computer craft one quite honestly intimidates the crap out of me because uh, it does have actual live programming in it because uh, these different uh, turtles or what they called you can actually program them to uh, do all sorts of craziness advanced melee turtle that might not be a bad one to kind of protect the village 
Especially those creepers. Oh my gosh, I can't believe how many of them were involved there. Um, yeah. Really? A grenade? Conventional grenade? Uh, ooh. All right. Um, yeah, this is getting into some crazy stuff. Uh, let's flip through. Um, Titan stone? No idea. Puffy armor? <laughs> Crystal chest plate? No idea the durability on this tier 4 rocket. Okay, that's Galactic Craft. White gem sword? You know what? White gem, white gem, and a stick. Maybe we can. Uh, I'll say maybe we can bypass some of this. Um, the tinkers, at least. Um, I no idea how to collect gems or anything like that, but maybe we aren't bound to. Um, to tinkers and it looks like we have a crazy amount of materials that we can use in tinkers um, I don't know what any of this is extra utilities um, I've seen some of that before so uh, maybe that won't be such a steep learning curve galactic craft I've seen a little bit of that. Um, yeah, it looks like we can go to all sorts of crazy planets. So, um, oh, okay. Here's the uh, hearts that you can get with the different um, completion quests. But, uh, yeah, it looks like some pretty wild stuff here. For sure. Um, just flipping through this thing, this, this mod is absolutely insane this mod pack um i'll be happy just to get basic tools what is all this mess molten gold well sticky glue pig iron um don't know what any of that is oh this is all tinkers stuff holy crap cosmic unbreakable 122 attack damage. Yeah, I think we're a ways away from that kind of stuff. Um, iron bolts. Yeah. Wow, 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 wow. I wonder if this thing has got microblocks. If it does, we're in deep do. Okay, McCrayfish Furniture Mod. Um, I've seen this once, and... It looks pretty darn cool um, because I think some of these are actually functional type uh, blocks instead of just decorative. I could be totally wrong on that, but if I remember correctly, I think some of those might be. Oh, we got chisel too. Uh, some of those might actually be functional, uh, like a furnace. Uh, you know, the oven is actually a furnace. Um, yeah, okay, chisel. That's kind of cool. Uh, we've got some familiarity familiarity with that one from the uh, the uh, other series um, yeah Pam's Harvest Craft okay all this junk um, seen that before didn't really we haven't really magical crops oh this is where that uh, Minicio and all that stuff comes in um, and you can really go buck wild with that um there's actually a pretty good series on right now um a big youtuber vintage beef and etho and pause on pause are doing a uh, they're doing a sky block a sky factory 2.5 mod and uh, they really dive into the minicio stuff which is uh if uh you guys are looking for an interesting series to watch uh watch that one because uh, those guys are actually pretty funny and uh pretty entertaining so um RFT tools. Okay. That is basically, oh my gosh, uh, a very, Salamander's Eye? Mm. A very brief run through of everything that we are going to get to experience. 
Oh, it's daytime. Let me get the heck out of here. What am I doing? Um, we'll break you. Oh, we have wasted a whole bunch of day, haven't we? Yes, we have. Um, looks like the world stopped generating there, so I'll, we'll have to look into why that is occurring. Um, wow, we wasted a whole bunch of day, didn't we? Yes, we did. Yes, we did. And we are actually short on time. Um, looking at the time, we should have ended by now. Um, don't want these to be too terribly, terribly long. So um, I'm going to go ahead and call it here. There's an oak tree over there that we need to take down to get that quest. Um, I am not going to get any complete any quests. Um, I may complete them, but I will not collect the rewards. Uh, without you guys uh, that is one thing that unless I absolutely have to if I'm doing something off camera and it's a matter of life or death basically um, I will go ahead and collect the rewards but I will wait to collect any rewards for you guys so uh, on that note if you guys uh, want to see more of this series go ahead and leave a like uh, from what I have seen there is some absolutely insane stuff that happens in this series. Uh, Blood Moon, where uh, basically you can't sleep through the night. Um, all sorts of all sorts of craziness, and uh, obviously we just flipped through the the 180 pages of uh, items and other things that uh, are associated with this mod pack so it is quite extensive and uh, quite honestly a bit intimidating but uh, hopefully uh, you'll stick along with me on this ride and uh, maybe we'll learn together and uh, you guys can uh, feel free to play along and maybe we'll uh, we'll learn together on it and uh, we can help each other out but uh, anyway go ahead and leave a like if uh, you want to see more and go ahead and subscribe uh, I do want to start uh, adding a little bit of variety to my channel. Uh, right now I've got uh, two series that have been going pretty strong. This is a new one and I just started a 7 days to die series which I'm really excited about. Um, but I do want to add a little bit of variety. Maybe not have you know, the, the same series multiple times show up in the same week. Uh, maybe twice a week. But I do want to stick with a daily video. So. Uh, but uh, anyway, this is uh, Five Guy Four Four Eight signing off for now. You guys take care, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye bye.